We've seen these before, Traxxas Canyon Trails, 1.9s. But have you seen a set of rims that look as beat up as these? No. So, can we turn something that looks like this into this? So here we are. If you're tuning into this and you want to do something similar to your, your own tyres, once you got them off the rims, if you're using anything sharp, a little disclaimer here, if anyone using sharp items, be careful. Uh, make sure you don't cut yourself and anything you do do if you watch these videos it's kind of done at your own risk but i guess you get that already what i want to do is i'm just gonna bring it down so it's just flat with that again i don't know how well that's going to be showing up oh yeah right so i'm just going to hold it against the side and keep your fingers out the way just push it through take your time concentrate on what you're doing as well so it's looking better already as you can see that taking all that down flick it over i'm going to do the other side so the next step once i've done that front and back is where the tire has been glued onto the tops here i just want to take the blade nice and sharp and just keeping it on the top just score the blade down it and that'll take any excess glue off so once i've done all that these uh, little bits on the Traxxas rims that pop out, I didn't paint over them, so I take a different style chisel and I just get in there and I just gouge them out, just like that. And then once I've got all those out, I'll go in with a 2mm drill bit and then a 3mm drill bit, just very lightly, just to concave it a little bit, uh, and then I can put some paint in. Now I use a bamboo stick, so while you use it, just push it into your hole, depending on how deep you've got your hole. And just twist the paint off the stick, and the hole starts slowly filling up. If I can get that a little bit closer for you. Just turn it off, and as you can see there, you manipulate it with the tip of the skewer, or I'm using a bamboo stick. Just go to the next hole, just twist it off. Make sure you hit the walls of your uh, your hole. Obviously, it'll make it easier if you hit the walls of your hole, and just pick up a little bit more paint, and go back in, and that will fill up. Each time you add a bit more paint, obviously, the hole kind of sucks it off the uh, the stick. And just keep going until you're happy, anyways, that your holes are filled. And if there's any little mistakes, it's because it's acrylic paint I'm using. You can just go over it with a little towel and just take them back out. So that's all I'm doing in order to fill the holes up. Once you've done that, your rim will look like that. So I mean, I think that looks fantastic. So far, so good. Stick with us. I'll show you the next step. Right, here we are. See if I can get this done for you guys. So all I'm doing is I'm using some crimson red, loading the paintbrush up, but I'm not actually using the paintbrush as in like brushing it. I'm just letting the uh, the paint come off onto the rubber. It kind of takes it off the paintbrush itself. And I'll just go over this lightly first, the first time like that. Just putting some paint on because that's going to dry in to the rubber. And then I'll go over it again a lot neater. So as you can see, that just highlights the letters, and I'll uh, I'll go over the rest in white as well. And what you end up with is something that looks a little bit like that. What do you think of them? So there we have it. Some new canyon trails for Traxxas. I'll just move them. Maybe you can see them a little bit better there. All nice, whited, nice and supple too. These have actually got those in there, so. We all know what those are. Hair donuts. I think we've heard of them before getting used for crawler tires. By the way, you're best off buying eight because you'll probably find four of the same size in the eight that you buy. Bit dodgy, but never mind. So these have got two in. As you can see there, nice and subtle. Um, oh now guys, what do you reckon of them? Anyways, 
from how they started to how they finished you can see the paint's cracking a little bit just on the rotation here but um, I got informed off Billy from RCU next Tuesday that detailing your wheels never lasts long look at those awesome kind of way to get those on a TRX4 give them a try with a new hair curlers in or hair donuts that's what they are but anyways guys I hope you've enjoyed that one like comment share and subscribe and as always see you in the next one